Good morning. Another beautiful start this Thursday morning. 33 degrees right now at Sandia Peak. But you know what? It's chilly, but not as chilly as yesterday. Yesterday you started off at 11 degrees. So it is cool out there as far as the rest of the state is concerned. Some of you are actually starting off a little cooler than yesterday morning. Albuquerque down to 37 yesterday. We're in the mid 30s right now. 32 in Santa Fe and in the teens and 20s up in the northeast and even in the upper 30s and low 40s down across the southern half of the state. So chilly out there, but it doesn't feel as cool as yesterday because we don't have the wind around that we had yesterday. The wind's much lighter today, and that will be the story throughout the afternoon. So again, shaping up to be a gorgeous day. Once we get through this chilly start, temperatures are going to warm very nicely for today. High pressure is going to move, be moving on out. We're going to get into more of a westerly and even southwesterly wind, which is a warming wind. So temps today 10 to 15 degrees warmer than where they were yesterday. And again, wind's not bad today, but that changes tomorrow. Area of low pressure is going to be headed our way, and we're also going to have another strong jet stream right over us again. So we're going to be looking at those winds, perhaps getting up to 60 miles per hour again out east. So we could be looking at a similar situation to what we had on Tuesday. We could be looking at damaging wind across the uh, the central, the east part of the state in the east slopes of the central mountain chain. So something we'll keep a close eye on. The warmer weather sticks around for Friday before it cools back off again for the weekend. Winds again, nice and light out there right now. We do have to watch out for the fire danger, though, with all the dry air in place. Fire weather watches have now been upgraded to red flag warnings, and that's for everyone with the exception of the southwestern portion of the state. Your forecast now for the northwest today. Sunny and mild. 64 in Durango, 74 in Grand, 73 in Farmington. A beautiful day today. And tomorrow, not looking too bad either. A few more clouds around, but temperatures will be warmer. Nearly 70 degrees in Durango tomorrow. Near 80 for Farmington tomorrow. And then 50s as we head into the weekend and the chance for showers moves back in, but at least the winds should start to calm down a little bit over the weekend. South and west, sunny and warmer with highs in the middle and upper 80s today, down into the 40s tonight, 80 tomorrow in Silver City, and then 60s as we go into Sunday and Monday as some cooler air tries to sneak into the area. South and east, plenty of sunshine, nice and warm. 78 in Portales, 82 in Roswell. We'll be in the middle and upper 80s for Artesia and Carlsbad. And then tomorrow as the winds crank up, the warmer weather moves in to 95, the high for Roswell tomorrow. And then Saturday will be in the 80s, but Sunday we go back to the 60s. So it will be quite a change going into the second half of the weekend. Those temperatures really cooling down. North and east, mostly sunny, a little breezy up this way. We can see winds gusting to 35 miles per hour at times, but not too bad. Temperatures in the 60s and 70s this afternoon. Las Vegas, 76 tomorrow, and then back into the 40s on Sunday with a chance for showers moving in and still quite chilly on Monday. Northern Mountains, plenty of sunshine and mild today. Middle and upper 50s for Red River and Angel Fire. 67 in Taos, 70 for Santa Fe. Mid 70s for seven, Santa Fe tomorrow. And then we're back into the 50s with the chance for showers moving in Sunday into Monday. East Mountains, mostly sunny with highs in the mid 70s this afternoon. And for the metro area, plenty of sunshine, a lot warmer than yesterday. Highs in the upper 70s. And then tonight, not as chilly, upper 40s and low 50s. For lows tonight, 80 tomorrow. And then we're back into the 60s on Sunday going into Monday.